Before you can change a data type to your Access database, you need to make sure that you're in Design View. This is the easiest way to change your data type. So in order to do so, um, you can see in Design View your field names and then the data type beside it. If you click on the data type, it's going to give you a drop down menu. And these are all the data types that you can use um, for your uh, field. Now, the most common ones are going to be text, and text is up to 255 characters. Um, number is a very common one. That's any kind of number. It can be negative and positive numbers. Date and time. Currency, which is different from the number because it's specifically for currency with the decimals and the dollar signs. Um, those are really the most popular ones that you're going to likely use. The other ones are memo, and the memo data type is for large amounts of text. This is up to 65,536 characters. Um, auto number, this is when um, you can have this field if you want to have access automatically assign a number to each new record that you create so every record has a unique number. Yes or no data type means that you're going to have two choices that you can have, yes or no. OLE object isn't used very often um, and it holds any bo embedded binary data. Usually people use the attachment option instead of the OLE, op OLE object. Um, hyperlink is if you want to store any hyperlinks to websites and then the attachment is if you want to attach one or more separate files. Uh, so those are the data types and um, that you can apply to any field in your access database.